Good morning, everyone, from Prince George, British Columbia, Canada. Uh, my name is Kevin Brown, working with the Hydra Energy Communications and Marketing Team. We're here this morning outside Lodgewood Enterprises. Who's Lodgewood Enterprises? Well, I, we're glad you're tuning in this morning because you're going to meet the president and CEO uh, who's uh, embarking this morning on a grand adventure to uh, make the world a little better place by reducing emissions and uh, we have two top speakers to tell you more about this story. Uh, I'm going to introduce uh, first Jessica Verhagen, CEO of Hydra Energy, who in turn will introduce our CEO extraordinaire of Lodgewood Enterprises, uh, Arlene uh, Gagne. So with that, uh, settle in for a few minutes. I'll just let you know that the first part, our live stream will be done from this location. You can see the cool truck behind me, eh? Then we're going to take the media here in Prince George on a bit of a closer tour uh, after Jessica and Arlene finish their remarks. So with that, please welcome Jessica Verhagen, CEO Hydra Energy. Thank you, Kevin. Uh, thanks for joining us on our exciting day today. I'm here with uh, Hydra's co-founder, Badr Abdul Jawad, and our CTO, Joe Bork. And we're just thrilled to hit this uh, milestone today. It's a world first where we have a hydrogen converted truck being delivered to a paying fleet customer. Uh, you can see the truck behind us here. Looks like a regular truck running on diesel, but it's actually running on up to 40% hydrogen. Uh, Hydra got started uh, to decarbonize trucking. We saw a large untapped potential in the trucking industry for cleaner solutions, but there wasn't any available that was affordable and scalable. So today is the first truck of 12 uh, with our Lean's fleet, and we're hoping to grow that in Prince George to 65 trucks. Uh, the truck here today uh, this will reduce GHG emissions by up to 40%. Uh, the reason why that's important is because heavy duty trucking represents a huge amount of greenhouse gas emissions today. In Canada, the trucks that are on the road, these types of trucks are 1% of trucks, but they represent over 30% of greenhouse gas emissions on the road. So it's a huge milestone for Arlene to achieve this emission reduction, and we're so happy to be part of that story with her. Uh, we set our sights in Prince George because we also have the hydrogen supply coming from Chemtrade. We announced that partnership at Hydra back in February and they're supplying low carbon hydrogen. Uh, so what gets burned in the truck, of course, hydrogen doesn't have a, a carbon molecule, so you're burning clean, but where the hydrogen comes from, we have to think about that too for the whole emissions life cycle. Uh, coming from Chemtrade, we've got an independent analysis of that carbon at 5.6 grams a megajoule. That compares to diesel at 75 grams, so a really significant emissions savings in this application. Uh, and then finally, before uh, we bring Arlene on board here, uh, I think just wanted to remark that in these times of COVID, it can often be an isolating experience or a divided experience. And uh, it's really a, a milestone for us not to just deliver the truck, but to do something together, uh, to bring our worlds of trucking and tech, uh, colliding the two and so much more innovation can happen when you bring two different worlds together. So we're really pleased with the feedback that we've gotten from Arlene, from Percy, one of her drivers, from Premium Truck, from the BC Trucking Association and others. It's all led to improvements in the way that we deliver this technology. And we're, we couldn't be more grateful and proud of uh, the Lodgewood and Hydra teams for working together to hit this big milestone. So thank you to everyone for contributing to this uh, success. And we look forward to working more in Prince George. Thank you so much. Over to Arlene. Thank you, Jessica. My name is Arlene, and I am the President and CEO of Lodgewood Enterprises. I sit on the Board of Directors with the BC Trucking Association, and this is where I met Jessica for the first time, I believe, in the Hydra team. It's been a long process and a lot of work to get to this, but I truly believe that being innovative in trucking is important. We want to start reducing our greenhouse gases immediately. We want to be part of the solutions for our province. And I'm incredibly proud of all of the people and this whole team that I've gotten to work with 
to make this come to life. When I saw this truck yesterday first roll in, I was overwhelmed with emotion. My, my feelings were so proud of everyone, I, I couldn't believe it was actually here. This is a huge thing for trucking today. Um, you know, we're really struggling with driver retention, with obtaining new drivers and obtaining interest from those who may want to explore our field. This is, like Jess said, bringing tech to trucking. It's making a cleaner world. There's a lot of us on the roads today. So here we are, we're gonna make a difference. I wanna thank a lot of people that were part of this journey with me and with Lodgewood and my team first and foremost, of course. The driver of the truck is gonna be Percy Hurd and he's pretty proud to be here as well today. He'll be showing you guys the truck. Um, my mechanics, of course, who are very intrigued with this whole solution and being part of a better province and a cleaner air. And then of course the dealership, Tom Coffey, a premium truck and trailer. This wouldn't happen without him as well. So all of the people and those that I may have forgot, I hope I didn't forget anyone. Um, thank you very much. This is, uh, this is a big day for trucking. Thank you, Arlene. Thank you, Jessica. Uh, thanks, everyone, for tuning in this morning from Prince George here. Uh, as Jessica and Arlene have said, a very, very proud day, not only for Hydro Energy and Lodgewood Enterprises, but uh, this is going to transform the trucking industry, not only here in BC, but across Canada and North America. And to know that it started here in Prince George with a couple of visionaries who uh, who not only just think about climate change and what some of the solutions may be, but actually put their minds to, let's, let's make something good happen. So thank you both, Arlene and Jessica. And for those uh, excellent uh, applause from the peanut gallery at the back there, thank you again to the Hydra team, Lodgewood teams. And uh, at this point, folks, we're going to say goodbye uh, to you uh, watching via live stream because uh, Percy, Jessica, and Arlene are going to now show the media here in Prince George some close-up uh, features of this grand new truck. So we wish you uh, a good rest of Wednesday and a good rest of the week. And goodbye now from Prince George, B.C.